Okay, so what we're going to be doing is we're going to be uh, creating a fake egg. Uh, it's going to be the same weight as a real egg. Uh, the purpose of this is for um, events where you're going to potentially be destroying an egg. You don't want to cover your device in egg every time you test it. Uh, so the best way to do that is to make a fake egg, have the same weight, um, see if the orientation stays correctly in your device whenever you need to use it, um, see that your device works correctly with that weight, etc. Uh, what you need to do though is you need to fill it with um, molding clay or paper clips. Um, do make sure though you do not fill it with Play-Doh. Um, Play-Doh is water-based, whereas molding clay is not. The water base will dry out and your weight will change, so do not use Play-Doh or any other water-based clay. You need to use oil-based clay. Um, what you're going to do is you're going to take your fake egg, you're going to put it on your scale. Now, uh, the USDA um, says that a average grade A egg will weigh roughly 60 grams, um, average by the dozen. So what you need to do is make sure that your fake egg weighs 60 grams. So you're going to put your empty egg on the scale. Make sure to keep that weight included. Um, don't just weigh out your clay. If you do that, then you're going to have extra weight if you don't use your clay. And then just kind of go a little bit by a little bit. Until you get to 60 grams. That's close enough. Then you're going to take your egg and all of your molding clay and you are going to pack it inside there. Now this may shift around a little bit when you use it, um, a little bit more if you use paper clips or something like that. However, that's okay. Um, real eggs, they also shift around so no, no problem with that. Uh, once you get all your weight in there, tape it up good and tight, make sure it's not going to pop open, and you're good.